Hey, what's up guys? Back again with another video. Just wanna share 10 headlines from Breakthrough Copywriting today to give you some inspiration for your copy. Um, it's really helped inspired me, so I just wanna share that with you. So let's dive in. Okay, so here's the headline templates. I just noted them down, wrote notes uh, from the book about each one. So let's go in and through them here. First one, who else wants to? So this headline is effective when your prospect has a desire or goal and by just naming it, it'll incite an awareness of it. Who else wants six figure residual income? Who else wants to get at luxury products at Walmart prices? Um, so this is a very interesting one. Uh, I'm definitely gonna use uh, this one. And then give me blank and I'll give you blank. So. Give me X amount of time, so five number five days, and then uh, I will give you a result that you really want. This is another interesting one that I think I'm gonna use for one of the clients I work with uh, in the car care space. You know, give me X amount of time, five minutes, ten minutes, and I'll give you, you know, a clean car, clean wheels, or something like that. And then, do you recognize the seven early warning signs of blank? So. Uh, if it's a problem that a person's going through um, or they're worried about or they're concerned about, um, you'll find this out through research. This is a headline for that. Get rid of problem once and for all. So works when your prospects have a problem that they're well aware of and will quickly recognize and acknowledge this problem. So get rid of your retirement worries, if they're worried about retirement, get rid of sleepless nights once and for all and then a, a tip from the book is you need to actually be able to solve this problem in order to use this headline i think that's a good tip for all these headlines and then this one is playing off kind of social proof so thousands now you know do this thing uh who never thought they could so that's like the full template so thousands now do something who never thought they could Use this when people doubt their abilities um, to get the result themselves. And then to effectively use this, you need to be able to prove to others that, uh, or prove to people who are reading this that others have used it and used your product to uh, achieve the result that you're, you're talking about here. It's a very much like social proof driven headline, um, like a sales message, message there. And then build a blank you can be proud of. This one was interesting. Um, I'm definitely gonna try this one out. So the example was build a body you can be proud of. That was for like a workout product. And then the book said, people are emotional about things, are more emotionable, emotional about things than they admit. Lots of people are secretly dissatisfied about almost every aspect of their lives. If you have a product or service or an info product that can help them improve their life in any way, then you're in a good position to use this headline and build a sales message around it. So, um, yeah, this is very interesting. Uh, it's good, like, inspo. I'm gonna try this one out. See how easily you can blank this new way. So see how easily you can get beautiful portraits made or get result. Uh, See how easily you can have a great website. See how easily you can get more done in this new way. So I think this one is pretty solid to test out as well for any message. And then, do you make these mistakes? This is a hook that I've seen work well on TikTok UGC as well as like talking about mistakes and helping people avoid mistakes. So a lot of like TikTok videos will see like three mistakes to avoid with this topic or something like that. But uh, it was good to see this headline. So do you make these mistakes in English? This headline helps people avoid costly mistakes that others often make. And then when you can demonstrate in your copy how the mistakes people typically make are costly. So uh, in this sales message uh, or video or whatever that you're writing for, you would just like give an example of like the actual cost uh, that the mistakes cost people <laughs> so cool and then do you make these marketing mistakes do you make these management mistakes or more examples and then the ninth one is what's new in blank so what's new in like a category that you serve 
or a product that you sell. So something that your customer buys from you, is familiar with, and is interested in. So people are very focused on their interests. Don't use this headline if you don't have anything really new and different about your product or service or offer. So another one to test out there. And then the lazy blank. So the example here was the lazy man's way to riches. And then a lot of people are not lazy, but they have so many things to do that they feel like they're lazy. And it, it really doesn't matter if a person is lazy or not. When people read this, they're gonna read it because they will think if a lazy person can do it, right? It must mean that it doesn't take a lot of effort or sacrifice. And it's probably something that I'll be able to do as well. So um, how I read this is I like reference Alex Ramosi's uh, value equation and effort and sacrifice is one of the pieces of the equation. And if you can lower the perceived effort and sacrifice, it increases the value of the entire offer. So like, okay, like this headline definitely makes sense and I will give it a try. But those are all the examples. I hope this was valuable. Um, definitely pick up this book. Um, all these examples are from this book. And there's a lot of like bullets as well. It's good, like copywriting knowledge there. So. Hope you enjoyed, go pick up the book and I'll see you in the next video.